guys, how you doing? <laughs> Welcome to Josh Strasash. Welcome to another reaction with the Although queen. I might fall asleep in this one. With the queen of the reaction channel. And yes. Because. Because, listen, your boy works hard, tirelessly, effortlessly, okay? Effortlessly. The symbolism gods speak through me so I can give you the symbolistic reviews and reactions, okay? Now, the reason why I work hard is because... No, you don't. I edit and YouTube all the time, okay, right? Okay, all right. Why are you trying to make them feel sorry no, for No, 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 but they need to this so they can understand the context. It's on limited hours now. No, no, no. I came Con from work context. yesterday. Let's, no, context. let's, let's context. get the context, context. right. Context. I worked, context. I was out the door at 7.30 yesterday morning. Wow, that's sexy the way you're doing it. I yes, went no to work um, in the school I work at. Then straight after that, I ran to my other job. And I worked as my swim teacher. Then I get on an hour and a half train to get to this guy. I want to sleep. We start sleeping. <laughs> this guy every five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm like, I was incorporating them snores into my dreams. Like they were in my dreams, you know, when you when you can hear something and it becomes part of your dream. That was happening, so that was fine. But then when they get closer and louder, yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, baby, you're snoring. It's out of control. Yeah, but listen, this I got a massive nose. No, but okay? it's because you're lying on your got back. Got a hay fever. Then push me on my back. We're a team. You don't you like you me need touching to push you me. when I sleep. What do you mean? I, I don't want you hit to you. touch. Yeah, but you you're you're like Ash, move. I didn't do that. You need to be... No, I didn't. What did I yeah, do? Yeah, you did. You I went... I said, Ash. No, you don't. You're snoring You're out aggressive. Control. I didn't. In bed. Right. Yeah. Good Will Hunting. <laughs> yes, guys. We're here to watch Good Will Hunting. Listen, before we get into it, let me just say, I've seen the poster and I'm the biggest, the biggest, and I don't even want you to compete with this, Robin Williams fan, right? So... Being born in Iran, yeah, you don't watch comedies, right? Because you can't understand American or English humour, right? So we watch like Jean-Claude Van Damme, Bruce Lee movies, martial art action movies, yeah? Now listen, what Look you at doing? that bit of fluff he had on his head. <laughs> <laughs> I'm getting emotional talking about Robin Williams, yeah? No, Robin, Robin Williams, this man means a lot to me. And I don't think I've seen any movies after when he passed away. So No, I haven't. Yeah, I think this one's going to make me sad. emotional just seeing him. So this, this, this is going to mean a lot to me personally. Um, because he was the first ever English or like non-foreigner that I understood through comedy and through humor so it means a lot to me so guys before we get into it and and i know you want us to get into it you dirty dirty human <laughs> go onto my patreon finger that subscribe button caress that like button let's get into it look you're my best friend so don't take this the wrong way 20 years, if you're still living here, coming over to my house to watch the Patriots game, still working construction, I'll fucking kill you. Oh, wow. Equations. Oh, my God. Do you ever terrorize your teachers in school? No, I was very nice. I couldn't stand my maths teachers. No, I say that. They're so rude, few. and they always expect you to bring your, like, calculators and shit. I'm like... I do that shit in my head, fam. And they're like, yeah, but you need it. I just used to make a nice connection there. They knew I weren't going to do much work because I wasn't very good at work. But my science teacher used to give me sweets to do a question. We Why, had... they used to bribe you. <laughs> he will never make films again. Oh, look at this lady. Hello. You're I good. love saying hello to old ladies. And then as soon as they start talking about the, the weather, I'm like, listen, bitch, I'm out. <laughs> no, I have nice chats with old women and old men. Bet you do. I do, actually. I had a nice chat with an old man in the sauna the other day. What? <laughs> Hold up. You can't just drop this no, in the middle of your by, reaction. Look, written by Matt Damon. Don't and change the subject. You had a nice conversation in the sauna. 
Yeah, two old men actually. And two. One They're lovely. One You're lucky. I'm not a jealous me guy. This is how making he's me in jealous. love with a woman, but she doesn't love him back. And then the other one was moving house in a few months and talking about that. Wow. How sad is that, though? So sad that you did that to me. I also put an advanced Fourier system on the main hallway chalkboard. I'm hoping that one of you might prove it by the end of the semester. I would be sleeping, baby, in the back. No, I'd be interested, but Fuck it wouldn't go lesson, in. this lesson, baby. F like, there's nothing more boring than equations. Why don't you... That's and no your one ever, opinion. No, and no one ever uses Why equations. Why don't you stop slating intelligence? Like, it's an uncool thing, because actually... We'd be in a great situation if we did understand it. What she draws a dick or something. He's a genius. I didn't get on Kathy last night. No? Wow, wow, look at Ben Affleck. Oh. Look how young he was. He's got the same chin as you, honey. They both wrote this. Oh, fuck you and your Irish curse, Chucky. Like, I waste my energy wow. spreading my legs for that tootsie roll dick. She's missing a tooth, bro. Yeah, exactly. Fix your Just teeth first before today. dissing my dick. Wow. Maybe Ben Affleck's chin yeah. is literally like yours. It's like she cheeks. Right now, she They're like these big cheeks. Do you know what I mean? You just want to stick your face in it. Wow. You want to stick my face in your chin? Mm hmm Okay. Look, genius. He knows what he's doing, this guy. Could he not have just got a pen and paper? He's, he's extra, isn't Arty, he? Arty, isn't it? He's the type of girls vegans would just die over, you know? I like his top. What? Vegans would be like, oh Doesn't even God. make sense. Doesn't even make sense. He doesn't write doesn't on make paper. Sense. He's saving trees. He, he rather writes on oh, windows. that makes sense now you've exactly. explained it. Go explain your Symbolistic. joke, baby. That's embarrassing. Oh, he figured out the equation. MC squared times 17 with 17 brackets and a triangle. Who figured this out? Who did this? Jack? It wasn't me. Amish? Why is no one claiming it? Because they're honest, smart people. No, I know, but people. you someone. I rather to ascertain the identity of the mystery math magician. So without further ado, come forward to Silent Road and receive thy prize. He's not in the class, is he? I... Man's clean the toilets. There is a problem on the board right now that took us more than two years to prove. The gauntlet has been thrown down, but the faculty have answered. Why is he talking like that? Like he's in Lord of the I, I, Yeah, but exactly. And I'll be there. And you expect me to understand this? I just came to the country. I haven't even got a passport, bro. <laughs> and you're saying about vigors and dyes? Just put a camera on it, no? Oh, he's going to see him. He's going to see him. What is these lines, though? That's people's work. You can't graffiti here. Don't you walk away oh, from me. Oh, they think he's hey, graffiti. Fuck, you're a clever one. What's your name? Oh, he Go vanishes. and have a look at the wall. Come on. Judgmental prick. Exactly. Tell him, baby. Tell him. Here we go. Look. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Now what do you have to say for yourself? Looks right. Oh. What do you think he has? I think he's had a really rough... Time like a rough childhood, maybe always stems from the parents. Yeah, it's an Irish bar, right? You're Irish, look of an Irish. No, wow, no. Can I get the fight? Can I, can I, excuse me, can I get the finest logo? They'll be like, Are you a fucking brown leprechaun, bitch? <laughs> They wouldn't, and I'll they just wouldn't run associate away. you with Irish at all with that accent. Hey. Very smart. Hey, how's it going? How are you? Good, how you doing? You want it? What, I don't... Uh, what class did you, did you say that was? Uh, shut up, you f***ing nerd. I remember that class. It was, um, it was just between recess and lunch. Clark, why don't you go away? Oh, she's British. Oh, hey. Why don't you go away? She's got away? a sexy voice, baby. She's got a sexy voice. I was just hoping you might give me some insight into the evolution of the market economy that uh, prior to the Revolutionary oh, War. Get I will revolutionize away. my 
fucking fist up your ass and make you into a fucking flag, bitch. Go away. Hang on, sir. You're a first year grad student. You're talking about how the economies of Virginia and Pennsylvania were entrepreneurial and capitalist way back in 1740. <laughs> That's going to last until next year. You're going to be in here regurgitating Gordon. She's Wood. like, oh. oh. Would drastically underestimate. Would drastically underestimate the impact of social distinctions predicated upon wealth, especially inherited wealth. You got that from Vickers. <laughs> page 98, right? He knows the page. Hey, Forrest, do you have any thoughts of, of your own on this matter? Uh, she is... Kareem. Yeah. You dropped 150 grand on a fucking education you could have got for a dollar fifty in late charges at the public library. Oh! But I mean, if you have a problem like that, I mean, we could just step outside. We could figure it out. No, oh, man, there's no problem. Oh, my. Yeah, he's hiding God. behind his books. I love this guy, but, you know, he's not happy. Is tell he? me, baby. Tell me. He's not happy. So he still is doing something. That's morally correct. He's got something. No, no, no. You, you <laughs> didn't get any of what I was saying. Like. I Sometimes love what I he's just done. I think words, that's amazing. You know? But I want him to be happy. He needs to find his happiness. Oh, I shit. I swallowed a bug. Yeah, she's going to swallow something tonight. You're an idiot. I've been sitting over there for 45 minutes waiting for you to come and talk to me. But I'm tired now and I have to go home. There's my number. So maybe we can go out for coffee sometime. See, that's... Just, why are you going home? Just go home with him. What are you going to do with your mate? Baby, she doesn't want to go home with him. Go have fun with him. Go figure some algebras. No, she's going to go and have Let him do the cunnilingus algebra on your pussy. Do you like apples? Yeah. He's going to give. Well, I got a number. How do you like them apples? <laughs> Oh, he's great. He's what does got apples a lot mean? Of built up apples? Apple. As in balls. Did I just say he's got a lot of built up apple? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, a lot of built up anger. No, no, but what <laughs> what but what I mean, what does apple when he say, how do you like well, them you apples? You are already saying what you think it means. Okay, but what do you, what does it mean then? Because you're the smart saying, one. How do you like them apples? Yeah, but surely it it, it symbolizes balls or tits. Maybe. Sorry guys, I can't get any symbolisms out of that. He's been trying the whole time. Anything. There's possibly. nothing. There's no symbolisms oh, look, here. He needs to clear out. Oh, there you go. This represents his mindset and where he lives. He's had a bit of a rough time. I can't give you his name unless you have a complaint. This is Professor Lambeau. This is Professor Hayes. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Fuck, his scarf it's is It's really, me this off. film is really showing. Difference of classes. Yeah, and also like, these guys don't care who you are. Yeah, get your scarf like, out of my face. And that is how it is. I don't care who you are. Talk to me nicely and, all your and I like you. That you spent 150 grand on. No, I, I admire that in someone. But it doesn't change if I like you or not. Mm. Excuse me. Excuse me. make a mockery of the court. I am afforded the right to speak in my own defense, sir. Wow. A liberty, in case you've forgotten, is the soul's right to breathe. I mean, it cannot take a long breath. Laws are girded too tight. Without liberty, man is a sinko. This is what I need in my life. A good book. No, you're about to say you need him in your life. No, you're I actually, wasn't. So, I actually so wasn't. So my symbol is, wow. You offended me there. No, this is what I need. You a want brain. a smart guy. Okay. Like this yeah, guy. you need a brain. You keep saying it. Wow. Well, you're you're I'm amazing. actually getting offended. Stop it. The dismiss is denied. Fifty thousand dollar bail. Thank you. Fifty thousand dollars. Ask this girl. Her parents probably have it. And the second condition is that that you see a therapist. <laughs> <laughs> Do it. Mate, we all need a bit of therapy. All right, I'll do the math, but I'm not going to meet with any fucking therapist. It's better than spending that time in jail, isn't it? Wow. He's probably more comfortable in jail. Oh, I'd love someone to offer me a bit of free therapy. Mm. Yes, please. No, no, I mean, I like, I, I go places, I interact, you know. Really? What sort of places? Just certain clubs, like, uh, like fantasy. Fantasy? It's not...
No, he doesn't. The music like owns you. It's like mm -hmm. that house music. It's like bomb, 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 boom, boom, boom. <laughs> He's just mugging him off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you find it hard to hide the fact that you're gay? I don't care if you putt from the rough. What are you putting put from the rough? What the heck you talking about? Raving loony in there. An absolute lunatic he is. <laughs> he loves outsmarting people. He loves his that. He, that turns him on. It's like a, uh, it's a figure. It's hovering over me. You're in a safe place, Will. <laughs> oh, I don't like this kind of therapy. Do you? It makes me it's touching me. <laughs> Where is it touching you? <laughs> down there. It just shows how much of a fraud it these shows, people are. No, it shows. No, not at all. It is some of Can these you... waste mans. They're like, oh, let me rub your sh like in Fight Club. Like, no, I'll feel tell you yourself. Something. Let me see your chakras. Let it me shows... show me your cave. Can I say something? Yeah. It shows how much he's shut it all out. Whatever's happened to him, he's blocked it all out, and he will not. Yes, I Open agree. I agree. To anyone. I agree, right? But it's also showing that he needs someone who actually For knows sure. about therapy. These guys are frauds. The wolves in sheep's clothing. If you're symbolisms. ready to open up to people, then it would work. But he needs someone a little bit deeper than that. <clears throat> trust is uh, trust is life. No. Wow. Wow. It's, it's very deep. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, Rob. Trust I, God, his life. Please, man. Jesus. This guy is amazing. Robin Williams gets me emotional so much. I don't know what it is about him, but it's just his voice. It's so calming, you know? And he's funny. Oh, I'm, this is going to be fascinating. Mm. How are you? It's not going to work straight away, though, is it? You know, you'd be better off shoving that cigarette up your ass. It'd probably be healthier for you. <laughs> yeah, I know. It really gets in the way of my yoga. <laughs> what, you lift? Yeah. What do you bench? 285. What do you bench? You paint that? Look, he's he's a bit thrown because he's like, oh, he's giving me it back here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's actually listening to him. He's not doing much talking. No, what he's doing is what every therapist should do and just having a normal chat. You don't go deep straight away. Yeah, yeah. He's hunting for how Will's brain works. You're just pissing your pants. You're crying for the harbor. So maybe you do what you got to do to get out. You know, maybe you became a psychologist. Bingo. That's it. Let me do my job. No, you start with me. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> maybe you married the wrong woman. Oh. You should watch your mouth. Oh. Yeah, you don't talk about his dead wife like that. What happened? Come Did on. she leave you? Come on. Boom! If you ever disrespect my wife again, I will end you. Fucking end you prick with your shitty haircut. I've never seen that side of Robin Williams before in a movie. This is going to be movie. a situation of they both help each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They both give each other therapy. I'll understand if you don't want to meet with him again. Oh. Tuesday, four o'clock. Make sure the kid's here. Wow, he connects with him. No, he's like, well, yeah, he has that, but he's also like, I mm. need to be around this guy to really manage myself here mm. too. Wow, baby, I love the way you articulate these words. <laughs> Sometimes I say these things like, so I could get, because you see your boy's an immigrant, yeah? It might be an excuse, but my vocabulary is GC, like it's basic levels, right? It's not goodwill hunting levels, right? Mine is like Ben Affleck's in this, okay? So I need Hannah to help me out. She's I'm my will any, and I'm hunting better. for Hannah. Right, we've used that one already, haven't we? Do you want to come up with something else? Let's, we can take some time with it. You don't need to use it again. You keep pulling my hair. Yeah, that's what you want, kissing you and pulling your hair. Stop. Why yeah. is everything so naughty? Because you're doing this and it's turning you on. What do you mean, why is everything naughty? Have you seen what you look like? You turn me on. See? Sorry, guys. <laughs> Sorry. This, your boy's got game for days. <laughs> you know, I figured out at the end, my brain's going to be worth $250,000. She's not British. Why do they make 
It's like we've lived in like the Buckingham Palace our whole lives. If it makes sense with a story, I don't. Go I, for I it. barely know anyone who's ever been to a private school. Do you? No. Wasn't your ex in private school? Yeah, but I don't know him anymore. <laughs> oh, it's getting saucy in here. <laughs> no, but like... As I in, never knew anyone area. who went to a private no, school, I barely, but I did date one. I barely one. know anyone. That's why she likes Will. Fuck Will. Fuck Will. Does the other you happen to get a good night kiss? No, good night. Know, More I, than I, that. I good night, lady. Yeah, thank <laughs> you. Do you know what I think she likes about him as well? Posh guys are probably terrible in bed. But I think she knows that he's sick in bed as well. Because he fights he's and he's rough. Anger built yeah, up in he's him. gonna release that tension all over her. You know what occurred to me? You're just a kid. You don't have the faintest idea of what you're talking about. Why thank you. He's getting real with him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I asked you about art, you'd probably give me the skinny on every art book ever written. Yeah. Michelangelo. I know a lot about him. What the ninja turtle? Michelangelo. Who's um, Michelangelo? Just don't worry, he's an artist. If I ask you about women, you'd probably give me a silver, say your personal favourites. But you can't tell me what it feels like to wake up next to a woman and feel truly happy. You've got to do that. If you didn't, you'd be a bad person. <laughs> but you've never looked at a woman and been totally vulnerable. Wow! Feeling like God put an angel on earth just for you. To have that love for her be there forever. Through cancer, it's holding her hand because the doctors could see in your eyes that the terms visiting hours don't apply to you. I look at you, I don't see an intelligent, confident man. I see a cocky, scared, shitless kid. Oh. Oh, that big got me. I don't give a shit about all that because you know what? I can't learn anything from you. I can't read in some fucking book unless you want to talk about you, who you are. You okay? I just love that man. You're terrified of what you might say. Oh, wow. That bit was like, like, no matter who you are, you'd be like, oh, shit, I need to change my ways. I feel like it's so relatable that bit because everybody has been that at that point in their life where yeah. they just haven't experienced anything. It's like he's using shit that he's, then, he's smart or and the things that he learned, yeah, like the books and the knowledge that he has to hide himself behind those. Exactly. It's like he's made a wall out of books and he's like hiding behind yeah, it. that's what I meant and earlier And Robin though. Williams just punch through that that's shit. That's what I meant earlier where I was like... Oh, that bit got me so bad, babe. You ever been on a plane? No, but it's a joke. It works better if I tell it in the first person. Yeah, it does. Look at his beautiful smile. Like, he makes me emotional. He's just got the kindest face. I went on a date last week, going out again. I don't know. Why not? I haven't called her. Christ, you're an amateur. <laughs> yeah, right. But this girl's like, you know, beautiful. She's smart. She's fun. So are you. So call her up, Romeo. Why? So I can realize she's not that smart. This girl's like perfect right now. I don't want to ruin that. Maybe you're perfect right now. Maybe you don't want to ruin that. You want to ruin that? No, what's happening here is he doesn't want her to meet him again and think you're boring or you've got issues mm. and she'd be put off. Oh, wow. It's not the other way around. Baby, you're seeing through the lines. She used to fart in the sleep. <laughs> One night it was so loud it woke the dog up. <laughs> <laughs> she woke up and got like, oh, is that you? Oh, see, I didn't have the heart to talk. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> she woke herself up. <laughs> <laughs> the acting is amazing. Mm. Those are the things I miss the most. <laughs> People call these things imperfections, but they're not. Oh, that's the good stuff. Wow. You're not perfect, sport. This girl you met, she isn't perfect either. Now, you can know everything in the world, sport, but the only way you're finding out that one is by giving it a shot. Oh, he really misses his wife. God, we're, we're wrecks. 
You ever think about getting remarried? My wife's dead. Wow. Oh. Hence the word remarried. She's dead. Well, I think that's a super philosophy, Sean. I mean, that way you could actually go Look. through the rest of your life without ever really knowing anybody. He's given him therapy. Time's up. You okay? I wonder if they have, like, a film based on his life. Yeah. Sorry. Oh, he's getting the wet wipes out. Oh, are you going to blow your nose, Donna? <laughs> oh, man. No, it's just hay fever. Wet wipes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby, this man destroys me. I. It's just what he's saying. Like, it, that was so powerful, oh, no. you know? Really good script writing as well. You ever wonder what your life would be like if you, uh, if you never met your wife? Wonder if I'd be better off without her. No, no, no. I'm not saying like no. better off. I didn't mean it. Like, it's all right. see, he, see now he's, he's being changed. respectful. Respectful. Wow. He's being respectful. Yes. Now. So when did you know like that she was the one for you? October twenty first, nineteen seventy five. When did you know I was the one for you? Our first date. What date was that? When I woke up. The date. Next to you. <laughs> <laughs> on the first date. <laughs> also, that's bullshit. You didn't know on the first date. Yes, I did. Try I did. And you're so full of crap. I sat on your bed and I told you how I felt about you. And you thought I was a bit too much. <laughs> <laughs> that's why I relate to what he's saying. Because like... When you're truly in love with someone, like I am with you, you feel it, right? So like when he's talking about, you know, cancer and shit, you're like, oh, fuck. These two have the best relationship, don't they? You missed Pudge Fist's home run? Oh, yeah. To have a drink with some lady you never met? Yeah, but you should have seen her. Oh, oh my God. And who are the friends of yours? They let you get away with that? Oh, yeah. They saw in my eyes that I meant it. Wow. I don't regret the 18 years I was married to Nancy. And I sure as hell don't regret missing a damn game. That's regret. Wow. Wow. Even him saying wow is crazy. He, he's lost for words. Would have been nice to catch that game, though. I didn't know Pudge was going to hit a home run. <laughs> <laughs> he's literally taking a... I know. Oh my God, do you remember these? What is wrong with her? He's going down on you and you're making wishes like... Baby. Do that with your hand on his dick, you know? Just shut up. They're enjoying each other's company. Well, she's not. She's distracted looking at the magic she's, ball. Uh, There's one thing that's been missing. I would like you to give me... All right. She takes her teeth out. Oh, that must be an amazing... Because you... There's no teeth involved. Now that's what I've been missing. That was the most beautiful, earth-shattering thing ever. <laughs> Is there anything that I can do for you? And Mary looks up at him and she goes, Do That was a brilliant story. <laughs> we were mugging her off, right? I ben know. Affleck's story was dead, right? He, her story, banging. <laughs> yeah, Chief. Got yeah. the winning then lottery the, ticket right the here. Guy. What's the jackpot? 12 million. I don't think that'll cover it. Yeah, but it'll cover your sex change operation. <laughs> Oh my God, <laughs> both of the posters just fell. Oh my God. Oh my God. We gotta give this kid direction. Direction's one thing, manipulation's another. Yes. Well, maybe he doesn't want what you want. There's more to life Thank than you. a Fields Medal. This is too important, Sean, and it's above personal rivalry. Oh, he's making it all about himself. Figure out what he wants. That's a wonderful theory, Sean. It worked wonders for you. Oh! Yeah, it did you, Eric. Go suck a big gobstopper. <laughs> like, and <laughs> keep that mouth closed for a very long time, you silly sod. Welcome to California with me. His whole life is here. Why are you trying to change him? 
She's not trying to change him. She's trying to have a life with him, Ash. Because that's a really serious thing you're saying. I mean, I, I know. You could be in oh. California next week. He's, and, you know, you might find out something about me you don't like. And he's getting the ick. He's gonna. No, he's not, Ash. He's panicking that she's gonna wreck her life by going with him. What do you want to know? What? That I don't have twelve brothers? Yeah. That I'm a fucking orphan? Yeah, you don't want to hear that shit. cigarettes put yeah, out of me when not, I was a little kid. Yeah, but. Oh God! <laughs> I want to hear yeah. you say that you don't love me. <gasps> I don't know. Wow! Wow! He's doing it so he doesn't her life up. Yeah, I think that's what Robin Williams' character is trying to show him, like with the baseball like this, scene, yeah. that like sometimes it's worth sacrificing what you really want to do to like be with someone that you actually love, but he's scared of that. And that's what, but she accepts him. She just, but because he doesn't open up, she didn't know that he was an orphan and all that shit. I hope you appreciate what he's doing because I've seen how much he enjoys working with you, not against you. What's great about this film is at the beginning, you think he's going to be a savior. Mm. And it's not, it's Robin no. Williams. Yeah. He just wants for his personal gain. He's trying to use no. him. Not he's a little bit, to a degree, but he also wants to, like, he can see genius and he wants to exploit that. I'll give you a job myself. I, I just wanted you to see what was out there. Look, maybe I don't want to spend the rest of my life sitting around explaining yeah. shit to people. He's like those parents that want you to do maths and want you to do the subjects that they want you to do. Do you know how easy this is for me? And I'm sorry you can't do this. I really am because I... Sit here and watch you fumble around and fuck it up. <laughs> Talking to a professor like that. Oh my god. This is probably a total waste of my time. Oh, look at him begging for it. <laughs> yeah, but babe, you've got to remember he's dedicated his life to something as well. You know, sometimes. Yeah, but so stop manipulating me, man. I'm trying to help you and you're just like yeah, keep but pushing he also, me. He's angry at the world right now. Now all that his bad actions has made him now depressed as well. Like you don't need to inflict your sadness or your bad like emotions onto everyone else throughout life. Mm. Most days I wish I never met you. I didn't have to walk around with the knowledge that there was someone like you out there. Oh wow. He's almost jealous of what he has as well, right? Well, he's dedicated his whole... I, I didn't have to watch you throw it all away. Well, he's not he does... throwing it, but he's, but he's not throwing it all away. He's but working on it. It's different priorities for different people. Like, we've got to understand that. I know, but he's being selfish. Just, sure. Just respect that he's yeah. in therapy and he's working yes. on himself. Yes, yes. you have a soulmate? I'm talking about someone who opens up things for you, touches your soul. This lady right here. I got plenty. Well, name them. Shakespeare, Nietzsche. No, not people in books. Great, they're all dead. Not to me, they're not. Nah, you don't have a lot of dialogue. <laughs> <laughs> You'll never have that kind of relationship in a world where you're always afraid to take the first step because all you see is every negative thing 10 miles. Wow! That's so true. I feel like a lot of people do this rather than just doing what you want to do. You could be a janitor anywhere. Yeah. Why did you work at the most prestigious technical college in the whole fucking world? Yes, that's such Why a did good you sneak point. Around at night and finish other people's formulas that only one or two people in the world could do. Because he obviously gets a thrill from yeah. that. Yeah. But he doesn't want to work in that mm -hmm. industry as such. You're lecturing me on life? Look at you, fucking burnout. Look at me. What do you, what you, do you do? want to do? Tell me, man. It's a really simple question that he's got very defensive about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he's. You and your bullshit. You got a bullshit answer for everybody. Yeah. But I ask you a very simple question and you can't give me well, a straight yeah, answer. He loves bringing the upper class down with his knowledge that he has because they worked you know, 150 he's got, he's got grand degrees. Against people with money. Thank you. That's what but I was that, trying to say. That, but he needs to learn, like, all he's doing is holding himself back by having that negativity towards I agree. a certain yeah. genre of people. Yeah, like, yeah. I agree. Isn't that just the exact same of what like he thinks they're doing to him looking yeah. down on him no you're yeah. looking down on them yeah if you like someone yeah. you like someone who cares mm. she's waiting for him and he's not gonna go 
It's because he hasn't figured out what he wants. Yeah, but he can just enjoy himself with her. Whilst yeah, but like, oh, what? It's staying in the same place. Yes, Hannah, but he's in the therapy. Of time that he's yes, been. baby, I get, I agree with you, but he's in therapy. He needs to find out what he wants before yeah. traveling I with know, this girl. I know, I know. Because then he could eventually hurt her there as well. So how's your lady? Ah, she's gone. Med school, medical school in California. He's gonna say, why didn't you go with her? What was this? It's like a week ago. Well, that sucks. He needs to hear some brutal facts from this I feel guy. Like he's gonna give something here. Yeah. Cause he looks up to him a little bit. Look, you're my best friend, so don't take this the wrong tell way. Tell him. Tell him. In twenty years if you're still living here. Coming over my house to watch the Patriots game, still working construction. I'll kill you. Yes! 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 Here we go. You owe it to me. Because tomorrow I'm gonna wake up and I'll be 50. And I'll still be doing this shit. I mean, you're sitting on a winning lottery ticket. You're too much of a pussy to cash it in. Hanging around here is a waste of your time. Everyone needs a friend like him. You know what the best part of my day is? When I pull up to the curb when I get to your door. Because I think maybe I'll get up there and I'll knock on the door and you won't be there. Wow! What a f legend this mate is. What he just said there has changed his life. Why is he hiding? Why doesn't he trust anybody? Tell me. Because the first thing that happened to him, he was abandoned by the people who were supposed to love him the oh, most. Oh, come on, don't give me that for you. Oh, no, listen. What do you mean? He pushes people away before they have a chance to leave him. It's a defense mechanism, all right? And for 20 years, he's been alone because of that. And if you push him right now, it's going to be the same thing all over again. And I'm not going to let that happen to him. Oh, he love you, man. I am what I am today because I was pushed and because I learned to push he's myself. He's not you. You get that? Wow, he's heard all of this as well. I can come back. <laughs> I was just leaving. Yeah, out, man. Selfish prick. He's got no one in his life. He's lonely as shit. And he's hiding behind his medals. He's obviously, he needs some therapy. He 100% needs some therapy. You see what he just said about his friends that he hung out with? The reason he hangs out with them is because of loyalty. Yeah. He's just walked in seeing this guy show him Showed loyalty. Him. Yeah, yeah. But in a different way. Will has an attachment disorder. Is it all that stuff? You see this? Holy shit. Look at me, son. It's not your fault. It's not your fault. Don't fuck with me. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I love that man. That's what happens when you don't give up himself on someone. Like you listen and you care about what they have to say, and you like take your pride and arrogant shit out, and you just listen and tap into their head. It's amazing, man. He's having to face some facts here. Imagine the power face of... The maybe, reality of it. Imagine someone, like, really getting to know you like, like that, you know, and telling you these brutal facts. It must be so hard to, like, face it, no matter who you are. Like, sometimes realizing that you're the problem it's so hard it is the hardest thing because all you want to do is blame everyone else yeah you get defensive you blame people you see the negativity but he's and saying shit. That he was saying he's it's not his fault but he's yeah. obviously fought fought that all his life like yeah time's up he doesn't want to leave so we're, we're done yeah that's it Done. Can I be your friend? Yeah. Can I come here every day? Still? Just, we don't even have to, like, you know, we could just grab a coffee. You do what's in your heart, son, you'll be fine. This is so emotional, isn't it? And they're not even doing anything that's that emotional. 
It is violate the uh, patient doctor relationship. <laughs> nah, only if you grab my hand. <laughs> Oh, he's it's so sad because he's not here as well. He's actually dead. It's the balance of you can still keep all the enjoyments. You know, it doesn't have to be like you have to give meeting up with your mates up. It just to balance do the, it yeah. to do the professor job. Here's your present. We knew you had to get back and forth to Cambridge for your new job, and I knew I wasn't going to fucking drive you every day, so. Friends are the best people ever, aren't they? These type of friends, though. Ones that brutally tell you shit that mm -hmm. you don't want to hear, and ones that got, like, loyalty and respect for you. Morgan was out panhandling for change every day. I had the road to do all the body work. Yeah, I have a fucking job too, brother. You see all those guys? You're that for me. Aww. Come on in. Oh, his face is just so lovely. You're making me wobbly. Oh. How about a drink right now? Yeah, it's a good it's idea. It's so Come on. nice that they have... I just wish someone could have saved him, you know. Oh, Ash, come here. You're going to make me stop crying. <laughs> I know, but you... Hey. Ash. Stop. Right on. Oh, look, his friend's gone to the house. And he's knocking and he's gone. Oh, he must be so proud, man. Yeah, but he must be like so a bit proud. Sweet, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, but you realise, like, it's not about you. Like, it's about what that person wants. And a lot of people are just so fucking selfish, you know. It's just beautiful for to have a friend like him to put that shit to the side and go, bro, I will fucking kill you if you don't go and do what you want to do, you know. Like, look at what you're doing. You're talented as shit, man. But people just have yes men in their life or people that just don't care. That and will they, help them. Yeah. yeah. They all need it, not just Will, like all of these guys, like... Professor calls about that job. Just tell him, sorry. I had to go see about a girl. <laughs> Son of a bitch. He stole, stole my life. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Imagine he gets there and she's in a relationship. <laughs> well, then no, he's 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 been it. fixed. He's been fixed. You know? Not fixed, but mm. he's he knows his purpose now. Because even if he was scared and he had that thing in his head about if he was to travel all these miles to go there and she would be in a relationship, he wouldn't have gone. At least it wouldn't have been... No, but it's that whole thing that he said about I wouldn't have regretted it. At least I went oh, sorry, to go guys. get the girl. Yeah. Ash, I've never seen you cry. Like that. Like that at a film. Green Mile has nothing compared to this, how much... No, I enjoyed this film. I know, it was an amazing film. Can I just say... You related a lot to the, the fact that he passed away, though. That was a lot of why you, you were crying. No, and also the message, like, mm. about, like, finding what you actually want to do. And, like, for example, like, you guys don't know this, but Hannah did the same thing to me, right? My mum also, but, like, during lockdown, I was talking to Hannah, and I was like, I really want to do this, you know? Like, I want to do YouTube, I, you know, like that's what I wanted to. She's like, she was 
she supported me throughout the whole thing. Do you know what I mean? She was like, um, oh. I can't talk. Oh, God. Stop. Stop. Because you're going to get me. This is ridiculous. Turn the camera off. No, come here. No, this is appreciation really time. Worry. This is Hannah appreciation time. Because, like, you yeah. have been you, you my, don't, don't my, to... fer- like, you know, oh. you've been like that. Because, like, like that. that's why I relate to this film. Because it's just about showing you, like, finding someone who gets you, listens to you, puts their selfishness to the side and, like, helps you. And that's what you've done. And that's why this channel's thriving. And now you're with me throughout this journey. So, like, seeing Robin Williams say that shit about his wife, like, I relate to that because I'm like, yes, like, now I get it. Like, you know, fucking around, like, and being single, yeah, it's fun. But, like, bro, finding someone, yeah, that you, like, like, you love, it's the greatest thing ever. You know, because look where it's got me, you know. And like, yeah, I'm talking about myself right now. But it's it's just, it's a, a this is honest. When I tell you, this is the it best film I've reacted film. to on this channel. It was one of them amazing films where you don't even need to say anything. It like speaks volumes in itself. Like I was in from the get go. Yeah. Plus, the music is really good, isn't it? <laughs> I, I don't even listen to the music, to be honest. I think Matt Damon as well. Like, you know, remember that line he was right, reading out? I've never out? seen him act. I think I've only ever seen, like, clips of him in something. My favourite scene. And it looked, scene. Like, it looked like action-y, but no, he yeah. was amazing. My favourite scene here was where he was sitting, Robin Williams was sitting him down and looking at the river, and he was telling him about how when you find like someone that you love how that feels and then then it just comes back to ben affleck right and him telling him do you know what's funny he went through all the therapists yeah even robin williams still didn't like got to him but his brother he's 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 yeah his brother that loyalty yeah his brother was more of a therapist than all of them without even him knowing it. He went, bro, I will kill you if you don't do that. After he said that, he went back to Robin Williams and he was like, okay, I'm here, you know? Yeah. So I just, I, I can't he needed, express he need com- how much I love this He needed confirmation that he wouldn't be letting down his friend if he left. He oh. needed that confirmation because, you know, I feel like everyone gets that. I would get that, you know? I don't want to let down anyone by cho- like choices that are selfish for me. Yeah. I can't tell you how much I relate to this movie and I love. And oh, this guy, like just seeing his picture now just makes me so sad because I wish he had someone to save him as well, you know? Uh, because It's very yeah, significant, this film. For me, it's, it's, it's just like he was the first person that Wait, made me laugh when I didn't understand English. You know, but yeah. Anyway. Oh, guys, man. what an emotional roller coaster! This guy. Yeah. You're dehydrated now. Oh, so dehydrated. You need some water. Yeah, my skin's gonna be sucked in. But guys, <laughs> I love you so much. Thank you for recommending this movie. Um, thank you to Hannah for coming as well. I love you so it's much. Very sentimental right now, isn't I, he? This you don't understand. Like it, he's like, going out for a drink with the boys. In I don't a bit. even want to. I wanted to. Uh, no, but now it's going to be like crying to the boys. Oh, You're going to be telling them how much you love them. I do. I love this. I lo- anyway, man. Thank you so much for reacting. Just uh, I, I, I can't. I'm love emotional. Love you guys. I'm emotional. Bye. <sighs>